Hello, 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 my name is Melanie, or J to the MN, and today I am going to show you my entire K-pop photo collection. This is like my weird little multi-binder. This is my Pentagon binder, this is my Luna binder, this is my Enhypen binder, and this is my TXT binder. A few days ago, I did post my entire BTS collection as well. Um, I have three binders for BTS, so it's just very overwhelming. But if you would like to see the flip through of this, then I will link it up above and down below. But I am so excited to show these other five binders to you today. Also, I am going to talk through it because I feel like you guys like it better when I talk through it. So let's go. Let's go. I hope you enjoy. Okay, let's start with the TXT. Also, if you hear any, like, thing like that... <laughs> I have my knee in a brace because while filming that BTS video, I rolled my knee. I have a bad knee. So now I have my knee in a brace. <laughs> the things I do for K-poppy boys. Because <laughs> I'm literally like kneeling like a pirate right now. And the brace knee is like the pirate knee. Okay, anyways. <laughs> TXT. Okay, so this is everything from Star. Um, if this is your first time watching my collection, um, Subin is my bias, but I also collect Hyunin Kai. I love him a lot, a lot, a lot. He means a lot to me. Uh, so... This is Star, this is Magic. They're magic little post-it note thingies <laughs> that I've never used. And then we have Eternity. And then we have Subin's Eternity Lucky Draws, which I'm so grateful. I got these right before all of their Lucky Draws started like going wild in price. Okay, this is the group uh, Eternity uniform. I would love to get Subin's. I feel like uh, that's definitely one of my high priority um, items right now, <laughs> so hopefully maybe next flip through you'll see it. Okay, this is um, the Weaver stuff for drama. This is the Wow Wow pieces. These are the postcards. These are the regular pieces. I don't know if I love it like this, but I thought it looked good in a four pocket like this, so <laughs> we're keeping it for a little bit, right? Uh, and then these are the drama postcards. And these are the drama flyers. I love these so much. I have to get the still dreaming ones of um, Subin and Kai. Okay, then we start into Blue Hour. I actually pulled this myself. Wow, like my biggest flex in the K-pop community. Uh, but this is all three versions. This is the Target group PC I hinted at. <laughs> okay, this is uh, three Subin Lucky Draws and three uh, Hyunin Kai Lucky Draws as well. Um, I don't think I'm ever going to go back and collect all of Subin's, but I'm so thankful that I have um, this one. So basically, these are from round one, this is from round two, but the backs of these are so perfect. I'm absolutely obsessed, so I feel very grateful to have the six that I have. Um, this is basically all like the pre-order benefit things. Um, this is all Subin's round one, two, and three of Yizniu. These are the two Mesimo ones. These are the Blue Hour round two pre-orders, which... <laughs> Weavers didn't send me them. It was a whole thing. I had to wait forever, but I traded with Bob for both of these, so wow, we love it here. Um, and then these are the Weavers round one pre-order benefits through, um, if you bought the albums singularly, I think. Yeah, if you bought them in the set, you got the, uh, it looks like a Mario box with a question mark, right? But very grateful to have this page. This is one of my favorite Subin pieces of all time. Um, we lost the summer dance bracket is like a lot. <laughs> I love the back of this too. Okay, and then these are all of the Blue Hour postcards, which are so, so very beautiful. This one's my favorite. And then this is um, all of Subin and Kai's Still Dreaming uh, PCs. I do have Subin's fan club PC coming to me from my friend Leah, and I think I'm going to stick it right here, and I'm so, so excited. He's got, he's got like the light blue grayish purpley hair but he looks so good and I'm so happy to finally have that PC. Also the bags of these. Wow wow wow. Um okay this is the still dreaming postcards and then it's the start of freeze. So these are the origin story cards. Uh, the way I'm missing Subin. <laughs> I'm gonna do a completing my freeze collection because I have everything coming on the way right. Um these are the regular album PCs. This is world, this is you, this is boy. This is the target exclusive. <laughs> 
Okay, uh, these are the Weavers pre-order benefit. They come in these magnetic frame things, right? But I was able to pull Suka. I'm so thankful. Um, okay, so the Naver pieces, they're hollow, so I definitely want to get both of theirs. And I think my Go host is going to get a set of them, so fingers crossed. And then these are Apple Music pieces. I bought Kai from a friend. And then this is the Go host that so much of this stuff is coming from. They are, they are really, really kind. I'm very thankful for them. But, um, okay, so the uniform pieces. You know what? These... <laughs> I just found out yesterday that these are mini photo card sized. So my TXT album, uh, uh, this this is not completely prepped perfectly now. <laughs> but you know what? Maybe they'll do some other pre-order benefit thing. Or if they do a round two like they did for Blue Hour, I'll put those there, right? But those will not fit there, so please ignore that. Um, this one is everything. My friend Pat's doing a go for it. Uh, it's like the Subin Boy Scout fit. Um, the Shoppy one I love because it's double-sided. And then uh, the Yes 24s are not very good looking. Well, they're like the boyfriend fits, but they are like a really weird hollow thing, <laughs> sparkly thing. I don't know, but I have both of these coming from MK as well, so I'm very grateful. Okay, so this is going to be all three. I'm only collecting Subins for this. All three um, rounds of Yizniu from my friend Bob, who I love so much. And then all of these lucky draws are coming from, well, these four lucky draws are coming from MK. And then this one is coming from Louisa, who I just really love a lot. She does so much for TXT and Moa. I was very thankful for her. And then my friend Faye so helped me secure this one. But it's going to be both rounds of um, all of the lucky draws, right? So Soundwave, MTU, and Power Station and hopefully they all arrive soon. Um, the Aladdin uh, postcard I have, Subin secured. I think I'm probably going to end up trying to get Kai's as well. They're like really, really pretty, like rainbow, hollow. They're, re they're really, really cool looking. And it's almost like a mirror or back behind them. I don't know. I'm obsessed, so I'm like, screw it. I want it. <laughs> okay, this is for the postcards that um, I already have, hopefully coming soon. And then these are the postcards that came in a freeze obviously the world version and the U version and the boy version and then these are the broadcast pieces that I have basically there's five for a crown but I only have one Subin and one Kai and I'm happy with that I'm so thankful to have Subin's blue hour I definitely want to get angel and devil Subin as well even just one of them right um I, I love collecting broadcast PCs, but I always feel like I put it off, especially like with BTS, and I don't want to do that with TXT, so hopefully you see this fill out a little bit more soon. This is the Weavers New Year's Eve postcard set. This is the uh, the year prior's fan meet. This is the 2020 fan meet. Um, obviously this was very wildly timed because it was pretty much the start of the pandemic uh here in the united states right uh so i wasn't buying a lot of k-pop stuff i really regret it <laughs> i really would love to get subin's full set but for the time being i'm fine just getting one more of his and then getting two more of kai's and then this is the mini bag pc that came in the merch and mk is really really sweet and she is going to send me um kai's mini bag pc so this will be filled out eventually but i really would love to get all eight of subins but these go for so much money it's like absolutely surreal but it's definitely a priority of mine as well but um here's subins 2021 fan live uh, full set and here is kai's here is all of the units and then here is the bag pieces and the t-shirt pieces and the bandana pieces. Um, I always keep the units. Uh, you, you, you've you seen, like, I collect so much OT5 stuff, but then other times I'm like, oh no, this bread will look better if I just do Subin and Kai, and I did goes with two of my best friends for, um, these, and it was just, it was a good experience all around. Um, this came with the little book thingy. I don't love how this is set up, but I still wanted to have it on display in here, but I don't love how that's set up. Um, this is a prep for the Shine By Together DVD that's coming out um, very, very soon. Basically, uh, you get a full set of five photo cards. So I'm going to put, you know, Subin, Yeonjun, Bangyu, Tae, and Kai. And then I don't know if these Wow Wow <laughs> Shine By Together PCs are ever going to drop, but I thought it would look good to have Subin's together and Kai's together, All right? And then these are just going to be fillers. That's my, that's my vision. 
And then <laughs> these are like the little ticket cards for the Shine By Together event, obviously, <laughs> Sue and Kai in the unit. And then these are all of their little IDs. I'm obsessed with these because they look like little University of Michigan IDs, and I went to the University of Michigan, so I just, I love that so much. Um, this is Season's Greetings uh, 2020. Uh, I pulled Kai, and this was like, this was like my unicorn PC for so long, and I ended up getting it for such a good deal, and I'm still so grateful. This page brings me uh, an immense amount of joy. <laughs> and then this is 2021 Season's Greetings, which I love, and I especially love the backs of them quite a lot. And then these are the two random pulls in that Season's Greetings, and then I also plan to put the Shine By Together clear bookmarks right here. So I, I bought my own copy, and then I did a go uh, with my friend Angie, so I'm hoping I get Subin and Kai's. These are the Hour film strips. I'm not obsessed with how this looks in my binder, but I just think they're cute and I love bookmarky things, so I wanted to put them in here. <laughs> and then this is the random photo card for um, the Hour 2. Uh, I pulled Yonkai, but I recently traded for Sukai. I was going to collect all three, right, because Subin and Kai are in it, obviously in a unit together, and then I was going to collect, um, you know, the one with Subin, and then I already had the Yonkai one, but then I was like, Melanie, no, these are getting wild because Weavers won't put them back in stock, so I'm just like, I'm happy with the one, and then this is my, uh, uh, TXT Memories, uh, DVD PC, and I actually pulled Subin. I keep going back and forth if I want to get Kai's or not. I would get Kai's. I really truly would but I feel like it's a slippery slope and I just picture like collecting all of Jimin's DVD things right and how expensive that is and I don't want to have the slippery slope of like I always have to buy two things right so I'm just like Melanie be good just keep the Subin but this page is this page is a little wild <laughs> hopefully it looks better soon but this is the Star Seekers, uh, and this looks, uh, these are beautiful. I'm obsessed with these. I wish these fit in a six pocket. They almost do, but this is Subin, and this is Kai's. And then the back is the other three members. Really, really beautiful. This is my MOA membership kit for this year. This is kind of like the hair that Subin has in the Japanese um, fan club one as well. But they're really cute. Very thankful to have. This is the TXT light stick PCs. And then these are just uh, cute little um, cards uh, from Samoas that I love, from Faith and from Bob. I just love these. I think these are so cute too. The backs are really, really adorable. And I just really love Moas. I love trading with them. Um, Bob and Faith are two of my best friends. Very thankful that TXT brought them into my life. And so I'm like, oh no, I want to showcase this as well. So I thought it would be a cute little thing to put in the back. But I hope you enjoyed this. I know that I rambled on for a little bit. <laughs> TXT, I just have a very extensive TXT collection, right? Uh, and I'm very grateful and very thankful, and they're definitely the group I focus on second hardest to BTS, and I just love them so much. Uh, okay, let's get into another binder. Okay, moving on to In Hyphen, which is also a collection <laughs> that I feel like, I don't know, I've done a very good job with so far. Okay, so basically, um, this is the pre-order neck pillow, uh, PCs. <laughs> This is from uh, their day one merch stuff. This is their uniform stuff. So like if you got like a hair scrunchie or a hoodie or something like that, you got their group card and a random card. And I actually did pull Sunghoon and then I was able to get Sunhoon for a good deal. And then this is the Weaver's uh, day one pre-order benefit. And I do have Sunu coming as well, so that page will be filled out. I love in Hypen's backs. They're just so, like, beautiful and simplistic. I'm obsessed. But this is Sunghoon's full, um, day one set. I'm very thankful to have. This is Sunu's, uh, full day one set. <laughs> also... <laughs> Uh, Sunghoon is my bias, and I just also collect Sunu because I love him, and he was like my island bias. Well, I really, really love Sunghoon as well, and Taki, but basically, like, once I started performing, I just, like, realized that Sunghoon was, like, my full bias, but I still really love Sunu a lot, so I was like, I'm just gonna collect him for some things as well. Okay, so this page, I'm not gonna lie, it... <laughs> I just don't really like it that much, but basically these are two of Sunghoon's Lucky Draws. I'm missing one, and it goes for like low end $100 now, and I'm just like, and they're like the clearish, like, uh, transparent cards. I don't know. We'll see if I ever get it, right? But 
These are the light stick pieces for Sungoon and Sunu. But these two are Mesema pieces, and then this one is round one of Yizneo. Basically, I had secured rounds two and three as well, but then the seller fell through, their supplier fell through, and now Sungoon goes for an astronomical price. <laughs> So I really regret um, ordering through that seller and it's just, I don't know, it's, it's a whole thing. So I feel like this page is just kind of a bunch of random stuff, but I like to do with day one. But you know what? I'm thankful for what I do have, but she ain't the cutest page, that's what I'll say. But these are the postcards that came in the albums, both versions. These are the bookmarks that came. I would like to maybe complete the bookmarks one day. I don't know. I go back and forth. And then these are these, like, really pretty um, envelope things. The backs of them are really um, holographic. They have, like, a holographic stripe. But basically, I I don't know. I got these really, really cheap on Miyukyo. And I was like, you know what? I really like them. But then they kind of fit funny in binders. But I'm like, well, I got them. So might as well... <laughs> Put them in my binder, right? But I have Sunghens and Sunnyu's, and here they are. <laughs> I love Sunnyu's signature, it's so cute. Okay, this is, I don't know exactly, like, if this was just, like, a postcard that came with Lucky Draws. That's exactly what I think it is, actually. But my friend Amy, she did a um, Lucky Draw Go, and she got these, and she sent me one. This is Sunghens' complete collection for um, Carnival. This is uh, Up, Hype, and the Down version. And I'm very, very, very grateful. Uh, and I actually pulled this one in this one, I think. Yeah, maybe. The backs are really, really cool, too. <laughs> and then this is Sunny's almost complete collection. I do have Creepy Doll coming from my friend uh, Karen, and I'm so grateful. So... This will be complete next to my and binder video you see. And then this is Sung Hoon's Lucky Draws for Carnival. And this is the up version, which I got from Amy. The hype version, which I got from my friend Sophie. And then the down version. Um, I bought this one on eBay for a good deal. And this one I'm still missing. When I put in a Neokyo order, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna swallow my pride and spend the $40 and get it so the page is complete. <laughs> but I don't want to! <laughs> But I don't want to regret missing one like I am for day one, right? But anyways, this is the uh, Fever second round pre-order benefit uh, thing. So I bought a set of albums and you were guaranteed to get all three groups. Uh, well, the group in two units and then you got three random members. And these are the three random members I pulled. I pulled Sunghoon and Sunu and Jungwon. I'm like, wow, I can't believe. So I just decided to keep Jungwon's. Um, I might end up collecting the group pieces um, for each album and putting them here as well. I don't know. I go back and forth, right? But... That's something that you could see. Also, the backs of these. I'm telling you, and Hypen has the best card bags. And they have very good card fronts, too. <laughs> but these are just the tickets that were in each of the albums. These are the Weaver's pre-order benefit frame thingies. Kind of weird. I still put them in my binder. This is the Target exclusive postcards, <laughs> which you got, too. It's very weird. Um, this is the season's greetings. Um, I was able to trade for Sunghoon, and then I did a go and got Sunny. So I'm so thankful that I have both of their ID cards. I'm very grateful. Um, this is the New Year's Eve postcards again. And this is the start of their uh, fan live merch. I have both of their postcards. This is the ticket. It's so beautiful. This is all of Sunghoon's, obviously. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And this is his special card if you bought the 10-pack, uh, which I did. <laughs> and again, backs are so beautiful. I love this color. The same with Sunu. This is his full set. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And his special card. So, so cute. And then all the units. <laughs> So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then this is just one of the packs that I cut to make a filler for the middle. <laughs> and then, uh, these are the, uh, you got a special card in each of these packs. 
and it was really funny because I ended up pulling one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? And I was like, oh my gosh. And then uh, I pulled eight, nine as well, but it was uh, ten, but it was um, Jung Won, Hee Sung, and Jay. So I'm like, oh my gosh. But I ended up trading and getting um, Sung Hoon's and Sun Woo's second one as well. But I love these. They're so cute, especially Sung Hoon's. I'm like obsessed with this one. And it's in the middle. I'm like, wow, wow. And again, the backs are so beautiful. They remind me of the Fever Purita benefits, right? And then this is um, the uh, Deco package, the Gugu package, and I was able to get Sung Hoon. And I'm still on the fence if I want to get Sun or not, but I'm just really thankful with how this looks. I love his little drawing, and I keep uh, Sun on the back too. <laughs> it looks like an Alice Oseman character. I say that every time, but I'm like, wow. And then these are the Hybe Insight PCs of Sung Hoon. He's the only big hit member that I have here right now, and it just sends me. But here are his two PCs. So beautiful. And then the backs, they faintly say in Hype In. Um, I don't know if you can see, but they, they do in black as well. And then these are his postcards. And they say in Hype In. And Hype In Sight. And I'm so thankful. My friend Faye, uh, she's Heisung Alt. Uh, she has a channel as well. I will link her down below. She got me these and she has the best in hyping collection on YouTube uh, Anyways, but I hope you enjoyed this. I'm so grateful. I'm so thankful especially to have so much completed and I hope you enjoyed. Let's go on to another binder Okay, this is my Pentagon collection. This is a beautiful beautiful Hui art print uh, that my friend Melis got me. Hui is the reason I got into Pentagon besides my friends <laughs> Lee and Melis. And uh, Hui and me have like the same birthday and I just love him a lot. I think he has one of the best voices in K-pop and so it's just very fitting. He's the cover of this binder. But I am Wusuk bias <laughs> and I have a pretty extensive collection of his. I'm, I'm very grateful. Um, but these are all of the album pieces in chronological order, I hope. <laughs> Hi. Uh, very beautiful. I love the Dr. Baby PCs. The summer PC little like edge. I'm obsessed with that as well. He's out of his mind. He looks so good. Hello. This is that random Hong Suk card my friend Leah got me. I said I was going to find a spot for it. <laughs> uh, this is all of the With album. This is when I became a uh, universe and I'm very grateful. These are for pre-order PCs. These are the regular album PCs and this is his little scratcher that I never scratched. <laughs> And then we get in to love or take. So these are all of uh, romantic, sporty, mild versions. And I have them all. This one is so cute. And then these are two pre-order benefits. This is, is it Megstar? I think that's who I pre-ordered from. And I was able to pull this and I'm so grateful. But the rest of the pre-order benefits I did from a bunch of different people and friends. <laughs> and I collected them all. There is a couple solo PCs of him, and uh, there is a few duo PCs, like unit PCs, if you won the fan calls, and my vision is to put one of them here, but I just haven't decided which one I want uh, yet, or, you know, hopefully I can get one, but um, these are all uh, pre-order benefits now. <laughs> so, so, so many pre-order benefits, but feeling so thankful. He's so beautiful. I love this one. This one would be my favorite. And then, uh, this is his collab, which there's four PCs. I'm so sorry to this man. I only got my mans, but, um, <laughs> very thankful to have. This is, uh, the season's greetings the year prior. This is the season's greetings from last December. These are the Gorilla Japanese PCs, and they're double-sided. <laughs> so you'll see Edon and Jinwon, which makes me laugh, but we love it here. These are signed Japanese postcards of his from Violet and from Shine. I'm very thankful to have these. I just got those not too long ago. Um, more album inclusions that just don't fit in nine pocket things. <laughs> I feel like these are kind of wildly in order. Oh my god, I love this PC so much. <laughs> it's my favorite. <laughs> but um, this is all of his posters that come with Love or Take. I do have Mild sandwiched in between, just hidden. <laughs> These are with little stickers. I just think they're really, really beautiful, so I wanted to keep them. Um, this is Wusuk's. This is Hui's. This is Yuto's. This is Kino's. I think this is Kino's. I'm very confident, but don't quote me. And then this is, like, concert merch stuff. This is the Prism concert. 
This is the Pentagon on Air, which I think I might be missing a PC from, or like a, an inclusion from, but if I get it, then I'll just move this. This is his season's greetings postcard. I know it looks funny there, but I just wanted to put it in the binder, so I'm like, I'm just gonna, you know. Um, yeah, this is the most recent one that I watched with my friends. Loved it so much. This one is really, really beautiful because of the back. And then this is the club sticker, and then this is the black hall sticker that my friend Leah got me. I'm very grateful. But that is my Pentagon collection. I feel like I'm so thankful. Um, I didn't say this as well, but my friend Sana, she has, um, she 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 collects a lot of groups, but um, she basically sold me a bunch of my Wuzla collection right when I became Universe. And uh, she does YouTube videos. Uh, she does crazy big hauls. She's JK biased, and she has like the best JK from BTS collection I've ever seen. But I'm really grateful to her too for selling me so much of this collection to make it like much easier to collect and I'm so grateful for her as well but okay let's go into another binder and this is my Luna binder which is so exciting because uh, comeback is now paint the town is everything my heart is very very full I triple bias in Luna uh, Kim and Chu and Olivia but um, basically Blackberry makes it hard to get a lot of their older stuff, so there's a lot of fillers. I should replace these black fillers, make them white, make everything look better, or kind of like come to terms with the fact I'm not going to get some of this stuff. But I uh, definitely want to get Kim's uh, rainbow uh, solo album version for sure, that's a priority. But this is all the Kim stuff I have. And this is all the Chew stuff I have. Again, constantly begging for Chew's attendance card. Hi hi, my name's Melanie. <laughs> And then, like a whoop to the moon. Oh my god, I am so sorry. <laughs> Olivia. And then, Hustle. This is the very first Luna card I ever pulled, so I'm going to keep it forever. But the way that this page is just... <laughs> she ain't it. She's also... She ain't it either. <laughs> but okay, then we get into Hash. And I have Kim's A version. Choose pre-order, uh, my music taste pre-order, and then Olivia's B version should work on this a bit more as well. <laughs> and then we're into Midnight, where I actually have stuff. Well, this is the Midnight Festival, but these are pre-orders. These ones are so beautiful. All right. And these are more Midnight pre-orders. I should get another one, <laughs> but these are all I have right now, and I, I am very grateful. And these are pretty pricey now, so I don't know uh, what I will end up doing, but... Uh, I, 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 they're beautiful. I'm so thankful to have them. And then I do have a complete Midnight Collection. This is all of Kim's A version, all of Chu's A version, and all of Olivia's A version. Uh, this Olivia card put me through it because I accidentally uh, got this one, or I accidentally bought this one twice. It was, it was a whole thing, but <laughs> feeling grateful now. <laughs> and this is all of Kim's B version, Chu's B version, and Olivia's B version. So beautiful. And then all of Kim's C version, all of Chu's C version, all of Olivia's C version. And then all of Kim's D version, all of Chu's D version, all of Olivia's D version. Then these are the tickets that you uh, get in each of the versions. And the stickers. <laughs> and then this is going to be prep <laughs> for, um, for, for and. Um, so basically, I pre-ordered through my music taste round one, so I'm hoping, uh, you know, to get Kim Chu and Olivia or to trade, but this is going to be my pre-order page. And then again, this is all the A version, all the B version, all the C version, all the D version. And then this is how I'm going to do, because each album, I did, I did a whole video <laughs> about how I'm setting up for this comeback, but um, each version has 12 unique uh, calendar cards. So this is how I'm going to do all four of these. I'm going to put Kim Chu and Olivia here, and then on the back side, I'm going to put all the other members. And I'm going to do that for version A, version B, version C, and version D. But uh, this is some summer package stuff. This is Kim and uh, Olivia's attendance card. Again, I'm begging, I'm crying, I'm pleading, I'm on my knees. <laughs> I really am on one knee. Hi, <laughs> okay, this is Kim's 2.0 Orbit card. I need to get two and Olivia's. I need to get all three of a 3.0. Uh, this is the season's greetings for the year prior, and then on the backs, I put the other two, <laughs> there's five in total, and then this is um, this last December's, and again, I put all the backs. 
Uh, I put the other two on the backs. And then I have these cute little Polaroid thingies. I'm obsessed. They're so cute. Uh, this is the Orbit uh, 1.0, and this goes with the summer stuff. Again, I don't love how I have this set up, but <laughs> uh, we'll do something. We'll do something with that. And then these are the light stick postcards. Um, and I wish I had the light stick pieces so very badly. That's definitely something that's like high up on my Orbit uh, bucket list. But that is everything. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, my last binder is just a little <laughs> random multi binder, but let's get into it. Okay, this binder. <laughs> So basically, I just want to kind of play around with at least one mini binder, hopefully in the next six months, the last six months of this year, I will. But basically, this is just a collection of very random things. <laughs> okay, so uh, basically, uh, I, I am in love with Jenny from Blackpink and uh, Kai from EXO. So these are things that friends, sweet friends, have all sent me. <laughs> This is my favorite K-pop photo card in existence, but this is the nice start of this uh, very random binder. <laughs> and Taemin, obviously I love Taemin with my whole heart and soul, right? I genuinely would collect him. And then this is the start of my Woods collection. Um, I, this is what I want to put in a mini binder, hopefully, right? But this is the equal pre-orders and then just some stickers I thought were cute. I still have to buy the equal album. That's why I left these blank because I was like, oh, I obviously want to like pull his PCs, right? Um, these are the first press edition uh, cards uh, from Whoops, and then these are the cards I pulled from my Whoops albums. The backs are so cute, the backs are everything. Um, okay, and then this is the start of set, which is when I became moods. This is the Kino card that I pulled myself. These are two hollows that I think are with drama. It could be make star. It's one of the two, but I got them from Neokyo. And then these are all three pre-orders from my music taste. And then these are the first six QR codes that you got um, with the first press from a set. This is like my favorite card of the whole <laughs> comeback. I'm obsessed. And then these are 7 through 12, the last six QR codes that you got with the first press edition of set. And then these are all the photo cards that I have pulled. <laughs> uh, I haven't, uh, I'm not going to collect everything, but uh, I have collected everything that I've pulled. And this is the first card that I pulled. <laughs> I don't know how I want to go about if I want to collect more, if I want to do some trades for my more favorite looking cards. I don't know yet. But these are the postcards. These are the standard postcards that you get. I am missing one. And then these are the first press postcards. And I don't think I have all of them either. But I do have quite a decent amount of them. And then we move on to Purple Kiss. And basically, I don't know if I buy a swan or go on yet, but... <laughs> This is Goan and Swan's uh, purple backs, and this is their white backs. And then this is, is it Make Star or is that my music taste? It's the round one pre-order hollow, and I'm desperately looking for Goans, but people are wild. <laughs> Hopefully one day, right? It's Make Star. It says Make Star on the back. And then these are the stickers, and this is like the ticket thing you get with the album as well. And then this is my very extensive Mamamoo collection. <laughs> I love Solar from Mamamoo a whole lot. Uh, sweet friend, the friend who gave me the Taman card, gave me the Solar card as well. And then I did get Reality in Black, and then I did trades for all of Solars. But that is my very random, <laughs> uh, just little mix match of everything binder. But I hope you enjoyed. <laughs> it gives me a lot of serotonin to flip through it. Okay, that is everything. I hope you enjoyed. I know that that was a lot, right? Um, I'm just so grateful, so thankful for you guys that I can share my collections with you. You guys help my collections grow. You make collecting more fun. You make it more exciting, more happy. And I just thank you guys so, 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 so very much. Also, again, I did do my BTS one separately. I just, I don't want you to think I just didn't film it, right? Um, and again, I will link it above and below. Three BTS binders, a whole lot of stuff. But um, just thank you guys so much. I truly, truly love you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed this little mid-year update. And I can't wait to see what it looks like in December. <laughs> I love you, I love you, I love you.